control system. perspective uh, here we are looking into the continuous system at the moment uh, maybe we go about the Z transfer or the discrete systems later on uh, in the later part of the course uh, okay so uh, the thing is that uh, what is the Bible stability you know a system is stable if every bounded input yield uh, bounded output okay so so that's that's what like you know a sta Bible stability means. Like if you have an input, uh, if you give a bounded input or the input which is within the limit, all right, and you get an uh, uh, a response which is within the limits too, what you are expecting, all right. And such a system is called a stable system. Okay. So what is unstable? Like if you give a bounded input and you are getting an unbounded res response, okay, or your response is growing with time uh, as you. Uh, I, I mean, like when you give the input to the system, okay. And the third thing is that a marginally stable system, okay. So, what does a marginally stable system mean? A marginally stable system means that you know, if you give a boundary input, and for some inputs or some values of the input, uh, it gives you uh, a bounded res response or bounded output, and for some values or certain values, it is not giving you the unbounded uh, bounded response. So such a system is called like, you know, margin stable. Okay, for some values, it is giving you a control output. And for some values, like it's not giving you a control output. Okay, so such a system is called a margin stable system from the Bible stability. So basically Bible stability, it's depending on the uh, input as well. So now you have a system like, you know, uh, the Bible stability, you know, which is actually looking at the total response uh, due to the force response plus the natural response. Of the system. Uh, just to elaborate a little bit more about the marginal stability, uh, why your system is marginally stable. Um, for that, like for example, like you know, um, what does it mean? Uh, so, for example, you know, uh, an undamped system. Okay, the natural response for the undamped system. So, what is the natural response for the undamped system? Anyone? So, what does it mean? So, if you remember, like you know, uh, it was uh, um, sinusoids. Um, they are ne neither growing or not decaying, if you remember, all right? Uh, the case of four different cases, cases of second order system, under damp response, over damp response, undamped response, and particularly damp response. So undamp response is like, you know, that which is neither growing nor uh, uh, decaying, but is just, you know, oscillating with a certain frequency, okay? So if we apply a sinusoidal input, okay, to such a system, okay? And if we, the, the frequency of the, that input, uh, a sine wave, whatever we are applying actually, if it is the same as the uh, frequency of that undamped system, okay? In that case, your system will actually, uh, it, its oscillation will start to grow without any bound and your system will become unstable. Maybe for the rest of the frequencies, if you apply a sine wave, sine wave of certain frequencies other than its natural frequency or its uh, uh, frequency of oscillation of the undamped system, uh, for that system, maybe you are having, uh, you know, a decay in the system, all right? And you are having a control output there, all right? So for a certain frequency, your system is unstable. And for the other frequencies, your system is stable, all right? So that's an example, like, you know, of the marginally stable system. Uh, did you get that? Oh. Mm, let's move to the next one minute. So as uh, meeting will start within the next one minute. So before I start the next topic, uh, let me just review it, okay? Uh, so again, like, you know, we talked that, you know, uh, stability is one of the most important uh, criteria. If the system is unstable, all other analysis or design in the control system doesn't mean anything at all, okay? So stability, we define that, you can define stability from two different perspectives, from the natural response perspective. And the second thing is about the Bible, stability or uh, input and output uh, perspective okay so um, a system is stable from a natural perspective it, it, it responds you know if natural response decays to zero after a certain time okay but if it's not decaying or it's approaching infinity after a certain time it means your system is unstable all right and it, if it doesn't increase or decrease then your system is marginally stable from the bible perspective if you're giving a bounded or control input and you're getting a control output it means your system is stable but if you're giving the control input and but output is not controlled, it means your system is uh, unstable. 
and if for certain values or for 